Good morning. Welcome to the forecast discussion for Friday, December 17th, 2021. Of course, I'm your meteorologist, Stephen DiMartino. And before we begin, please like, share, and subscribe. Definitely do that as that helps the channel out quite a bit. Well, it is certainly mild this morning as a cold front is moving through the region. Temperatures range from the lower to mid 40s over the northern interior, upper 40s to lower 50s in the Delaware River Valley and mid 50s along the coast with a westerly wind around 5 to 10 miles per hour that is developing. When we take a look at our surface map, there is our cold front. This will be moving through today. Again, there's a threat for an isolated shower this morning, but most locations will remain dry. Other than that, sky cloud cover is expected. Then we're going to be watching a developing storm out here that's going to be moving through the region, bringing the potential for rain and also some interior snow, sleet, and freezing rain for tomorrow morning, making for some slick road conditions. So the cold air is bleeding in, setting the stage for that wintry mix by the time we get to tomorrow, at, tomorrow morning. Taking a look at our infrared satellite picture, you can see there is our cold front and there's our developing storm with the colder cloud tops getting in their act together. And so overall, what I'm expecting is a wave of low pressure to basically track right through the region, leading to the threat for showers throughout the area and a wintry mix of snow, sleet, and freezing rain tomorrow morning that will gradually change over to rain. So this is generally what I'm expecting here with this threat. For the coast, basically rain. You might see a little bit of snow at the very end of this, like early Sunday morning, but not going to be anything that's going to be anything uh, significant of nature. Maybe a trace on some grass or some car tops. The real concern is here, especially from about 2 a.m., uh, I'd say 4 a.m. to about 2 p.m. tomorrow where there's going to be this snow, sleet, and freezing rain mix that's going to gradually change over to rain, but not before producing a trace to two inches of snow. Most locations a trace because you're primarily going to see a sleet and freezing rain mix where you see a trace up to a tenth of an inch of ice on roadways, sidewalks, you have it. So it doesn't take a lot of ice to cause problems. So we've got to watch this for tomorrow morning. It is definitely a concern for basically the interior areas and then far northern interior basically uh, northern connecticut and up towards albany there uh, is potential for around three maybe as much as six inches of snow from this low pressure system before that changes over to a wintry mix and then rain so let's dive into this forecast for today cold front exits with sky cloud cover look for temperatures basically to hold where they are right now and then fall through the 40s this evening as colder air builds in. Look for increasing cloud cover with rain and uh, a wintry mix of snow, sleet, and freezing rain developing over the interior, rain on the coast. Look for low temperatures in the lower to mid 30s over the interior, mid to upper 30s along the coast. For tomorrow afternoon, everyone gradually changes over to rain with high temperatures ranging from the upper 30s to mid 40s over the interior, mid 40s to lower 50s along the coast. For Sunday, that low pressure system exits with all precipitation gradually changing over to snow, but again, not looking for much of any type of impact on the coastal plain, maybe a trace, that's about it. By the time we get to about 10 a.m., everyone is pretty much dried out at this point. Look for scattered cloud cover by the afternoon with temperatures ranging from the upper 20s to lower 30s over the interior and mid 30s along the coast for lows. High temperatures ranging from the upper 20s to lower 30s over the interior, not really moving all that much, and mid to upper 30s along the coast. On Monday, high pressures in control with sky cloud cover, lows in the upper teens to mid 20s, highs in the mid 30s. On Tuesday, High pressure gives way with increasing cloud cover. Look for low temperatures in the mid to upper 20s over the interior, lower to mid 30s along the coast. High temperatures in the upper 30s to lower 40s. And then on Wednesday, an area low pressure passes well off the coast. Could be a little bit of rain, snow, showers, but nothing too heavy. All the heavy precipitation will be off the coastal plain. Look for temperatures to range from the mid 20s to lower 30s for lows and high temperatures ranging from the mid to upper 30s. On Thursday, high pressure will be in control with sky cloud cover, lows in the lower to mid 20s over the interior, upper 20s to lower 30s along the coast, high temperatures in the mid 30s to lower 40s, 
And on Friday, Christmas Eve, an area of low pressure will be approaching for increasing cloud cover with showers developing towards the evening hours. Not looking for anything too significant just yet during this time period. But Christmas Day may be, well, a bit stormy. So we'll be keeping an eye on that. Look for temperatures on Friday range from the upper 20s to mid 30s over the interior and upper 30s to lower 40s along the coast for lows. High temperatures in the upper 30s to mid 40s over the interior and upper 40s to mid 50s along the coast. That is your forecast discussion for today. Have a wonderful weekend and as always, stay safe out there.